Hey, I'm Hugh, and I'm here today to talk to you about the Alpha Heat Heater or the Vista Heat Heater or whatever other name they're calling these cheap mini portable electric heaters that are claiming to be revolutionary. The two commercials for these products are almost exactly the same, except for they're claiming one was made by Tucker Johnson from Minnesota and the other was made by uh, Bastian Mantis from Czechoslovakia. Both these guys were raised by their grandparents. They know how hard it is for seniors to pay for heat in the winter. And because they're 20 year experienced jet engineers, they decided to put their theories to the test and create a new heater that using Bernoulli's principle can heat your house in minutes and uses 85% electricity. This thing is a scam. All electric heaters are pretty much the same, except for some have fans, some don't, some use infrared, some use ceramic heat, some use resistive elements. But guess what? A watt is a watt is a watt. This thing uses, it says 600 on low or 1200 watts on high. That's a, a smaller for electric heater. Usually it's 1500 to 1800 watts. But here's the thing about electric heaters. They're kind of unsafe to run. Not only are they a fire hazard if they get tipped over or if something gets stuck or, or accidentally jammed into them, but the wiring in your house isn't designed sometimes to continually feed, uh, you know, 10, uh, 12 or 15 amps to these heaters. Yes, they might work for a period of time, but over time where there's connections in the wall or where there's resistance, heat can build up if the wiring is not able to handle this. That's why they're banned in a lot of apartment buildings. So here is a space heater running in my apartment. As you can see, it's about 100 degrees coming out the front of the heater and the cord after a minute or so is already up to 86 degrees. This is showing what is going on inside the walls as well. This cord is designed to handle all the amperage and the heat from this space heater. You don't know if you have one connection at the wire nuts or in the box or somewhere else that is causing a lot of resistance that's gonna get a lot of heat over time. Now you can see 10 minutes later, it is already up to 101 degrees and that's at the plug that's designed for this. Okay, in one part of the video, it says that do not accept any substitutions. There is some knockoffs, but you know, you better have the genuine amper heat because they forgot to change the name from alpha heat to amper heat because that was the other name of the scam product that they were probably hawking last year. All right, this is a scam. It's not gonna save you a bunch of money. Let's just take a look real quick at the math numbers. Assuming 15 cents a kilowatt hour, I know it's higher in some places and lower in some places. We'll just say 15 cents a kilowatt hour. It's using 1.2 kilowatt hours every hour. That's 18 cents an hour or $4.32 a day. That's almost $130 a month to run this heater. And that's just to heat one room. And like I showed you before, it's really not good to be running these for a long period of time unless you are super sure of your wiring. And yeah, I'm sure it does work, but they're $20 on Amazon. They're not worth 50 or $60 or whatever they're charging on these websites for them. Thank you. Like, comment if you like, subscribe. You have a great day. I appreciate it.